Got it to half forward too. Out the back it went. Jetta's there. So is Yaron. Pretty clever player, Yaron. Some experience too, wrapped up by Lyle and pile of a bounce. 55 around from the Western Australia goal. Good defensive pressure early from Metro. And they'll need to do that to close these runners down from Western Australia. Roof open here at the Telstra Dome. Looks a bit ominous, actually. Uh, so he just bangs it high. McKernan's in the front position. Doesn't he leap like his brother, oh, Kevin? Just even the hair and the movement. It's, it's even oh, the well. kick. And some would say even that sort of a turnover every now and then. <laughs> Corey might occasionally make the wrong decision. This kid impresses me. Please. Please. I just love the way he picked that up then. He's done that twice already in the game. He's got great speed. He was left out of the game earlier. But you'd reckon Telstra Dome's the sort of ground that would suit Sam Blees. Yeah, just managing his workload, I'd think, as to why he would have missed. But he's been an impressive player through this championship. He has got brilliant speed and, and endurance. He's got, he's got that wonderful combination. And at just over six foot, and with his clean hands and good kicking skills, he, he's really impressed me, Sam Blees, in the last couple of months. Here's Sean McKernan, brother of Corey. He's banged home the third here for the Metro. Terrific goal. Terrific bit of play by Blees as well. Australia, so they have to square it backwards. Got numbers back. Goes back to McKernan. He just decides he's going to bang it long. Now, if it hits the deck, they should have the numbers here. Competed well, Vickery. Goal kickers in the first quarter. High ball, two on one, suiting Victoria. Punch came from McKernan. Shuey again, getting in his way. Though. Not happy with the treatment. In the fact, not charge. happy at all. Might be a free kick against Taylor Hunt here. You're fine. Spot on, Liam. McKernan involved again. Xavier Gotch, who's had a good game. 11 touches, is that Brad's boy? Brad's boy, yeah. Well, you rattle them off as we know them now. Palmer, well, he's been a star at AFL level. Carl Morton at Melbourne, very prominent. Chris Maston's already played some good games for the West Coast. David Myers at Essendon. Those sorts of boys have been prominent. Uh, Jaron Jackie, Stephen Brown. Jackie at Adelaide, Stephen Brown at Carlton. Already playing at the AFL level. That's seven or eight already, and there's another few to come through. McKernan wins this knot. Walters. Notice big Vickery coming off. A bit of blood into his face. He had to wear one, didn't he? Might have been from that assault. And that's yeah. actually a very good kick. He squared it up. That was a terrific kick. Watts had good position. McKernan comes in to help out. And they get away. On the overlap to Strauss to McKernan. Sean McKernan, he's looking inside. It's a wobbler, a floater, and a good mark by the big fella. Very unaffected. Lyle got it from Scully, bangs it forward onto the chest of McKernan, and Victoria will answer fairly quickly here. Well, it was a good kick by Lyle. He just kicked it into that little bit of space and made McKernan work to the space. And North Melbourne people will be thinking, Lyle, McKernan? Hmm, can we get our hands on either one of these boys? Not under the... Well, you're kin for the draft. There's no brother-brother <laughs> brother, rule. Brother-brother no, brother, 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 brother. rule doesn't work. And, and big, uh, big Moose Big didn't... Mark. He played about 38 games, I yeah, reckon. Big Moose didn't quite play enough games to get the father son rule. McKernan celebrates yeah. as he hits it. And the answering goal comes quickly. And Sean McKernan gets his second. So he joins Banner and Zaharakis with two each. And Vickery has three. And he's earned himself a spell. And speaking of Vickery, he will swap with him as he heads for the interchange. Kev, uh, watched young McKernan play in the TOC Cup Grand Final last year, and he looked like a, just an un, a real raw colt. Mm -hmm. He seems to have matured in the last... It's only been... Not this year. Uh, he's had limited game time today. They're just using sparingly. He's coming off an injury early in the year. Ken Luke Darcy, they're wonderful for the, for the ASAFL Academy program. Uh, for the boys themselves, but for their own personal development as they start to sort of look at this. So to McKernan for Victoria. Watts at the back. McKernan got it down in front. Lynch through trap.